This durable pet stroller is one of Petique's most popular pet strollers and I'm going to show you how to remove the material so you can keep your durable pet stroller clean and looking new. I'll start with the storage basket first on how to remove it. What you'll do is there are buttons here in the back. You just open it like that. There are three buttons total in the back. Buttons here on this side. Buttons here on the other side. Another button here in the front. When you do remove it, just remember where these go when you remove it. And there you have it. And see, it gets dirty down here. There's a board in here to remove. So you can throw this in the washing machine. And remember to put it in the washing machine bag when you put it in the washing machine and air dry it because the heat from the dryer will damage the mesh. Now how to remove the top part. What you want to do is unzip the bottom mesh and keep this mesh attached to the canopy. The material on the canopy does not remove as well as this back piece. It does not remove because it is attached to the canopy. I'll put this back piece on the top just so you can clearly see how I removed the bottom piece. While I'm here in the back, I will remove the leashes just so the leashes are out of the way when you put the material in the washing machine. I'll go ahead and put the leashes in the cup holder. You have the option of removing the mattress off or keeping the mattress on. So if you only want to wash the mattress, you can. You can just remove the bottom part. There's a pee pad insert where you can put your pee pad. So take out the pee pad. Put this in the washing machine bag and air dry it or line dry it because the mesh will get damaged in the heat from the dryer. I'll go ahead and put this mat inside and show you how to remove the rest of the material on the durable pet stroller. So what you want to do first is unzip the back piece and then go to the front here and take this part off. And over here, you see these straps that are looped on to the frame. You would take these straps off. Same with the other side. You would take this strap off. Make sure it's the bottom strap that is connected to the frame. You would just take that off. You have straps here as well. Take that off. And there you have it. Now the material on the stroller has been removed for easy cleaning. You have a supporting board on the bottom and to clean it, spray Petique's multi-purpose odor eliminator spray to remove any stains and you can spray the Instant Odor Eliminator X Plus to keep your board smelling fresh as well as kill the bacteria odors. And when that's done, you have to put this in the machine wash bag to keep all the parts safe and intact while it's washing in the washing machine. And when you dry it, air dry it or line dry it because the heat from the dryer will damage the mesh. Now to put the materials back on the durable pet stroller. I'll go ahead and put on the storage basket first just so you see it more clearly now that we have the skeleton of the pet stroller. So I'll go ahead and put these buttons on the back. The three buttons that were in the back, I'll put that on first. Button that up. As you can see, these buttons are really quality buttons. I really have to push it just so if your storage basket does get heavy, the buttons don't loosen up and your storage basket doesn't fall apart. And over here in the front, this strap here goes around this bar, goes around this part here and the other side as well. You see this bar, the strap goes outside of the bar, over the front strap. There you go. I totally forgot to put the board inside. So I'll go ahead and put the board through here. Ta-da! Now you have a durable storage basket. So now to put the material on the durable pet stroller, I'll take the supporting board first before I put the material back onto the durable pet stroller. And then that goes over. I'll go ahead and put that in there. I'll take these Velcros here 
And then you strap these around the bar. Make sure it sticks together. I'll take this strap, put it around this bar in the back right here, and then this strap as well. This, these two straps over here, they go on the bar here on the top by the canopy. There you go. Over here in the back is the same. I'll put this strap above this one that's already strapped in from the canopy. And then I'll take the second strap and put it between this bolt that holds the canopy and the strap that is attached to the canopy. I'll put this one in between the two. Now over here on the side, we still have this strap. We'll put this over this back bar right here. We have straps on the bottom here as well. We'll put these on the bar for extra security. Same on the other side here. There you go. And what you'll do next is hold this piece right here. Take the zipper, push that up and make sure your zipper is in. It's all the way in. So you zip it. And there you have it. As you can see here, we have two leashes and built-in loops. Over here, you can see there is a loop sewn in the side and a metal piece right here. What you'll do is you'll take the leash the end of it where it has another loop here you'll put that in the metal piece here like this and you'll take this leash put it through this loop and pull and that is how you remove the material on the petite durable pet stroller to keep it looking clean and new